we are going to learn how to add few more columns to your Jira board. So if you see, this is the default view where you have three columns backlog in development and done. But in our day to day life as a child teens, we might need more columns. So for that, you have to click on this three icon. You can see there is a, there is an option called both settings. Click on that. In both settings, you can see the second option says columns. Click on columns. And then let us have two statuses. Add status, name it as in QA. By this status, you mean that this feature is currently in QA. So a new status has been created. Now let's create another one, QA complete. And let this category be in progress itself. So we now have two statuses. Now we have to add two columns. For that, click on add column in QA. So this is your column name and automatically this status has come over here. So if you see, I can move the status over here also. I'll make one more column, add column ready for production. It means QA is complete. This is ready for production. So this is the new status. New, uh, this is the new column. Let me remove the status and add QA complete status. Now, if you see, you have five columns to do in development in QA ready for production. And when it is in production, you can mark it as done. Let's see how my board looks like. So click on back to board. So if you see now there are five columns. So as a product manager, you can keep the tickets over here and let the team pick the tickets. So now a developer can move this ticket to here when the developer concern starts the development. Please subscribe to my channel.